You guys are not going to want to miss this major Shiba Inu news update. What is going on guys? Kyle with Finance Bro here. Welcome back to another video. We are of course talking about Shiba Inu in today's video and we have a lot to discuss. So without further ado, let's get right into it. Milkshake, as you can see, tweets out an eyeball emoji and this is in response to the official Shiba account. As you can see, they are verified and they have 2.5 million followers. Just so you guys know, they're real, obviously. Working on amazing things. Hashtag Shiba Army woof. What could this mean? What could this be? Again, there's a lot of obviously speculation and mis kind of mystery around uh, this interesting tweet. We don't know. Obviously, that's a very uh, cryptic tweet to begin with. But I mean, there's a few things they could be working on. We could have some major progress being made with their video game. There could be this is a big one, but maybe there could be some type of special announcement coming as far as Robin Hood is concerned. We know that Shitoshi recently on the Weeble uh, I believe it was the Weeble. I don't know if it's the forums or the app. Let me know in the comments below, of course, if you guys know. But I believe he said something like there's a big surprise that could be coming sooner rather than later. Who knows what that is? We have to kind of see. But again, I think this is still exciting stuff either way. Uh, and it just shows that the dev team is definitely working on something. What that is is still, unremained, is, unre is still remains to be seen. But I do think that... Whatever it is, it'll hopefully help the price of Shiba Inu. Guys, real quick, if you haven't already, go follow us on Twitter at It's Finance Bro. And do me a favor, retweet this tweet. And then, of course, obviously reply. Do you think that Shiba is going to reach $1? Also, comment on this video if you think reach or if you think that Shiba Inu will reach $1. I want to know your guys' opinions and thoughts. Of course, in the comments down below. We have a lot to news to cover, guys. A lot of very interesting stuff going on either way. But before we do that, I really, really want to ask you guys to make sure to hit the subscribe button. It is the easiest and best way to support us for free it doesn't cost you a dime all you have to do is hit the subscribe button and you guys will get access to exclusive well it's exclusive at least on our end always up to date breaking news about shiba inu uh on a daily and even hour by hour basis so if you guys want to get access to that link down in the description below you guys know what to do Overall, cryptocurrency market is looking red today, guys. This is not a Shiba Inu specific issue. I have to say this every video because I always get people who comment, well, all this good news, but the price still sucks. You're stupid, right? And they, they say this to me and I'm like, well, I mean, look at the overall market, right? The market is down like 5%. Look at all these red charts. Look at all of them. Look at all of them. They're all there, right? So again, guys, you can't worry uh, too, too much about these types of dips and corrections. Zach and I have been buying the dip. Zach and I have been doing a lot of buying the dip on a bunch of different cryptocurrency projects, including Shiba Inu. If you guys actually want to see exactly when we buy the dip and when we buy anything for that matter in both the stock and the crypto markets, again, you guys got to access our Discord. You guys got to get in there for our private buy and sell alerts. It's super affordable. There's other groups that are like $30, $40, $50 a month. Our group is super affordable and we do some awesome stuff in there. And I think you guys really enjoy being a part of it so get signed up there get joined up i think you guys really enjoy being a part of that community let's talk news though first things first she burn in the past 24 hours there have been a total of 19 million sheep tokens burned in 11 transactions so far and this is a total a total of 410 i believe that's trillion right because it goes no it, yeah yeah it's 410 trillion sheep tokens have been burned from the initial supply of one quadrillion guys that is absolutely insane we know vitalik of course burned a ridiculous amount of Shiba Inu coins uh, way, way far back. I can't remember how far back it is. I think it was his last year. Uh, and he did that, obviously, right? That was really, really cool to see. Uh, the other thing, though, is that, guys, if you look at this account, if you look at how often they are tweeting, the community is doing so many burns. Like, look, 1 million burn or 1 million sheep tokens burned. Uh, let's see, another million sheep tokens burned. Uh, another million sheep tokens burned. Look, hour by hour, guys, the Shiba Inu community is on fire they continue to burn tokens at just an incredible rate and they just keep going and keep doing it it's so awesome to see just how strong this community is but also just to see how consistently uh they are burning tokens right we don't need mechanisms we don't need any new additions to the project just the community themselves uh is on the track to burn all these tokens and of course obviously increase the value of shiba inu over time which is just awesome to see so pat on the back for you guys out in the shiba inu army let's talk about this though guys because this is something that i think a lot of you guys are concerned about again there's a lot of anxiety unfortunately in the overall shiba inu ranks and just just and everything i get it i get it let me explain right so we know that crypto right now is not do, doing super well and that is obviously 
due to CPI data. Now you might be wondering, CPI data, inflation, like well, how does that have to do with anything with crypto? Well, unfortunately, and I say unfortunately because this is the way that it goes, crypto tends to follow the stock market. When the stock market sells off, we tend to see the crypto markets tend to follow suit. And when they do that, well, and you know, these types of things happen, right? And, and I think, okay, listen, it's Bloomberg. I know Bloomberg is a little bit more um, what you might call uptight, right? They're a little bit more, uh, you know, stock oriented. They only like growth stocks uh, or just any kind of, uh, you know, major asset that has, you know, you know, utility and, and it, listen, it's fine. All right, let's, let's read this anyways. I just want to cover this. Meme coins return to earth as gloom overtakes crypto fanatics. That's such a FUD title. I, I can't even. Okay. Cryptocurrency enthusiasts who piled into meme coins such as Dogecoin and Shiba Inu amid the long time industry rallying all of to the moon are finding this year's journey back to earth pretty painful. Uh, not really, right? Listen, of course, yeah, uh, the dip sucks, right? We, you know, nobody likes the dip, but uh, a lot of the community members, I think for the most part, have been very actually uh, rejoicing, right? In the fact that they can now buy Shiba Inu uh, at previous lows that we didn't see into, well, pretty much this last rally back here, right? And even then we're still way, way above what we were at uh, previously there, but uh, you know, we're still holding really well, right? And I still think that we can consult it at these levels. And I think most people, most Shiba Inu Army community members, they're still buying the dip. They're still buying the dip at these levels and we're still, uh, overall, the community still remains very strong. So I kind of disagree with that, but let's see. Uh, they kind of just recap the frenzy of Doge and all that stuff and they just kind of give some memes about, oh, look how stupid these holders are. This is why I hate FUD articles, dude, because all it does is just, it adds to the, to the anxiety that you might feel, that others might feel, your friends might feel, family members, whoever, who are also invested in these coins. It's just stupid in my opinion. It's like, listen, if, if you guys really think that the clicks on your article that you're getting from, you know, bashing, not just crypto, because they're kind of just bashing, as you can see, crypto fanatics. Ooh, okay. Uh, but overall, I just, it's a waste of time, right? As you can see, Duncan Gray said, January will be the month to determine the growth of Sheeb. I have a very good, oh, all right, let's open this tweet. What? I have a very good feeling we're on the way to the moon and beyond. And let me guess, they're probably making fun of this. Uh, stalwarts say Sheeb coin holders are on the way to the moon and beyond, but dedicated chat rooms show that the oft repeated rally cry appears to have lost some of its power i don't think so because let's go to the uh let's go to the replies notice how i'm still scrolling again like the the overall replies of shiba inu uh and just overall guys it's it's okay okay i just please it's everything's gonna be all right all right and i know it's hard to think about i know the long-term thesis of this coin is not something that most people take part in most people who buy this coin are going to be looking at their phone all day looking at the gains looking at what they're you know how much they're up how much they're down and i get it it's stressful but you guys have to remember that if you're a long-term investor zach and i on this channel we are long-term investors in crypto we buy on the dips usually, and we hold. We hold for the long term. We wait for those long term price targets to be reached because we believe in the token. We believe in the project. We believe in the fundamentals. And because we believe in those, typically we have a lot of conviction and we're willing to buy more even on the red days and we're not panicking. That is the key, okay? If you're panicking right now, please take a deep breath. Everything's gonna be okay, okay? It's all good. And the other thing too is that maybe you're invested with too much money. If you have thousands and thousands of dollars in this coin and you're only, and you are literally losing your mind on every single dip that we're seeing, maybe you're invested with too much money. Again, I'm not gonna tell you guys how to invest. You have to invest at your personal comfort rate and your personal risk tolerance, okay? That is something that I think no other guru on here really likes to tell you. They like to just go, oh, buy the dip, it's gonna be fine. You guys need to invest how what makes you comfortable. If you're not comfortable holding this coin and you can't handle the anxiety of the dips, especially with the crypto market, maybe it's not for you, okay? But if you can kind of rationalize your feelings and rationalize yourself a little bit and say, hey, it's okay, I'm gonna take a step back, you know, maybe you can make another decision, right? But you have to make the decision. I'm not gonna tell you guys to buy, I'm not gonna tell you guys to sell, I'm gonna tell you guys any of that, okay? You guys have to make that decision at the end of the day in the markets. I think GB New is still prepped and ready for a very, very good year this year in 2022. And just because we're dipping a little bit because the overall market's down, in my opinion, it's not a big deal, guys. Everything is going to turn out just fine. That's my opinion, okay? It's not financial advice. I'm not trying to tell you guys, buy now, sell now. I'm not telling you that, right? Make your own decisions at the end of the day, and I think you guys will be all right. But again, if you guys want to join our private Discord, uh, link down in the description below. If you guys want to support us for absolutely free, not a dollar to be spent, hit the subscribe button. It's the best way to get access to the newest and updated information on GBE, especially with the news that is happening literally every single day. 
So if that sounds interesting, again, it's all linked down in the description below. Make sure to follow us on Twitter if you guys have already. We also post quite a bit of news on there as well. And I think you guys would really enjoy being a part of that community as well. But other than that, guys, that is all I have for you guys today. I'm Kyle with Finance, bro. Take it easy.